Hello everybody, this is Dream of a Bath for another episode of Dinosaur Kitten. We're doing Awaker Mode again. And we are doing a challenge I've been meaning to do for about a month. Because this has been... This has been... Posted. Someone posted that they wanted me to do Goma with a certain dinosaur. And we're going to see if we can do it with that dinosaur. Alright, that dinosaur being... We are using the Zuniceratops. Dun 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 dun, the purple sheep of the herbivore. Well, of the, of the lightning dinosaurs. Dun 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 dun. Okay, we'll skip this bit. Okay, we are allowed... We're going to do three attempts. Because I have a feeling it's going to take three attempts to do this. Because it's, it's written go and, you know, Zuniceratops is not very good against him. Actually, it'd be a bigger challenge to do this with with uh, a wind dinosaur like Sejuan, because you'd have the type disadvantage to deal with as well. As well, but yes, there he is, the purple sheep of the herbivores, the lightning dinosaur, sorry, the Zuniceratops. Now I've gone with an interesting move set. You've gone with attack burst and electric charge because it should stack, and we got lightning axe as well for extra damage. So even though this thing's attack. Well, even though this thing has not much health, it's going to have a lot of attack. Oh, lovely. That's just the start I want. Okay, he didn't get a flare sword. Um, okay, so I'm going to go with rock. Yeah, we got the attack burst. Attack burst gets triggered when you beat your opponent's crit. Oh, we got lightning. What was this? Oh, lightning axe. Good start, good start, Zuniceratops. You can do it. I have faith in you. I will allow myself three tries. I may allow myself more, but I, I'm not sure yet. I mean, I might do it first try. You never know. Okay, so we got a Carnotaurus, which is not the most... Not the greatest dinosaur to have, but... Technically, if I swap it out back into Zuniceratops, I could screw Goma over with the Cyclone effect, so that would be the worst dinosaur in the world to have. Hmm. Okay, we don't want him getting burning that off, so I'm going to go for a scissors. Yeah, take that, boy. Yeah, boy. Hmm. Time for rock. Actually, on the top, while we're doing this, I will give out some helpful tips for people struggling with Goma. So, I will pause this here, and I will show you what this hint means. So, when this hint means, like, ignore any of, or basically most of this. The thing that we want is this bit by here. Because that tells you what sign Goma is going to go for. And this is the Japanese for paper. So Goma will be going paper. And we will go scissors. Just a little stranger tip for you. Ready? Bingo! Little tip for you there. Oh, we got the dino tip. Another tip is after you get a hit off on Goma, he will either match your move or beat it. And that will apply every time. So, we'll go here. I went, I won with scissors, so he will either go scissors or rock. Like, sometimes he will throw a curveball and go paper. That does happen sometimes, and there's nothing you can do about it. You can't predict it. It just happens. So this is where the randomness comes into it. So, the best move to go for in this situation is rock, because you will either tie or you will win. Like, again, sometimes he will throw a curveball and go paper. That happens. There's nothing you could do about it. You know, you can't predict it. It just happens. You just got to go with the punches. So I will go rock here. Ah, there's an example of it. He went paper. He threw a curveball and went paper. Like, you can't anticipate him going doing that. I mean, it sucks because it's a blow. But, you know, it just it happens. Right, another hint type. Again, a hint like this. What we want to look for is this sign by here. 
which is the sign for rock, which means Goma is going to go rock. So we are going to go paper, and we should get off the ultimate win. Oh, oh, I don't know if I should have swapped there, but oh well. <laughs> I, ho I hope my I hope my tips will help you out if you're struggling to beat Goma because he is difficult to beat. He can be overwhelming at first, but once you figure out him out, is not as bad. But again, sometimes he does have that randomness about him, and it happens, and there's nothing you can do about it. Right. So here, I don't actually know what he'll do. It'll pretty much be random. So we just got to hope, and thankfully, I didn't get the swap because we died. You know, that happens, nothing you really to do. I'm gonna sneeze. Hey, we got the hat! Got the attack boost as well. Okay, another hint time. Now we want to look for this sign by here, which is the sign for scissors, which means Goma will be going scissors. So we are gonna go rock! Boosh! Oh, we got the, uh, what did we get off? Lightning Axe. Boosh. Okay, now I actually have no clue what this means, so... Okay, yeah. <laughs> I, I theorize when he says that, that he either beats your crit or matches it. But I honestly don't know what he means by that. I'm sure people who can read Japanese will tell me down below. Let's go rock. Okay, that's a tie, that's fine. Okay, so again, I'm going to go rock. He's going rock, so we're going to go paper. Okay, I don't need to pause now. I'm sure you get it. I've gone through all three examples. Now, the key here is that... Oh, he's got an eruption. Is that we want to kill this Eocarcaria when we have at least two dinosaurs left. Because I theorize that when Omega comes in... If he throws a curveball then, or if he just gets the first hit, you need a second dynamo to back up on, because you're gonna you're gonna die. All right, this one is quite easy. When he when he does this, this means a crit. This means that he is going to go for his critical move. So that's probably one of the easier ones. You don't even need to read this. Like if you, as long as you recognize the text. You will know what he does, and he goes for a crit when he says that. So, the key here, we want to kill his Super Eocarcaria without losing this Cygenia. Otherwise, Zuni Ceratops is going to have to face it alone, and there's, a, and there's a big risk that he will hit me with a Phoenix and kill me. Okay, that is really good. We might have lethal? Probably won't. The Super Eel Tarkaria is annoying. <laughs> no, didn't think we would. Okay, I don't actually know what he means by this, so... <laughs> I'm going in blind. Oh, no, that's not good. Friggin' Max! Oh, he's got to ruin it, haven't he? Of course he gets his eruption off, a little bugger. Oh, oh, we're dead. <laughs> dun, 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 we're dead. Right, attempt number two. And yes, we got Zuni Ceratops back at it again, but this time we got Thunder Driver, because we needed, we felt like we needed a bit more oomph. 
And I don't think we need attack boost and electric charge. Hmm. Now, in this scenario, I feel like going scissors would be... Yeah, let's go rock. Oh, nope, nope, you went paper. <laughs> oh, I said I was going to go scissors, and I didn't. Oh, well, right. Actually, in this situation, because he won, he won with paper, so the best move to go would be a rock, because he will... I. He is anticipating that we are going to go scissors. So he will either go scissors himself, matching your move, or he will beat it with rock. So the best case scenario here is to go rock. Because then at least we land damage with a tie. And well, we get the tie and we swap into power. Skip! So not the best start in the world, but at least the Zuni Ceratops can heal. Okay, now, as I said, if you're in doubt, just pick scissors. That way, he can't get Burning Dash off, he can't get his crit off. Again, hit by rock is not too bad. Hmm. Let's go scissors. Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> wow, this is a really bad start. Scissors again. Hmm. Scissors? What more scissors? Yeah, we got him with the scissors. Finally, we got a hit. Hmm. Let's go rock. Ooh, we got a hit. I think I might have been right there. Two platoon crash. Oh, look at the eel character. He's like, no, please, no. I'm tiny. Boosh. Wait, what is this? This has got, got to be fought with, hasn't it? Okay, we got the Dino Tactor. So we're doing it again. We're going back into it. We're doing well. We're doing well. Like I say, it's, it's kind of disastrous if you lose a dinosaur on his first one. But so far, we've avoided that disaster. And um, is this lethal? I think he's just, he's probably just going to survive. Or it's not even going to tickle him. Nice, we wasted him. Um, I'm gonna go rock. Okay, that's not the worst case scenario in the world. Yes, we're gonna lose a dinosaur, but his burning dash is gone. So he's basically wasted it. Oh, yo, poor para. Okay, so we can go rock and we get a hit. Nice. Come on, Zuni Ceratops, you can do it. Oh, look at the damage. It's so pitiful. I mean, it's no less than pretty much any other dinosaur. Okay, so remember what we said earlier? See the sign for paper? We go scissors. We go for Thunder Driver. Come on, Zunita. This, is, this should do more damage. Boosh. Oh. <laughs> I think I did less damage on the crit. Right, you know what that means? He going for a crit. And so are we. Well, so this is not just a Zuni Ceratops challenge. This is a how to beat Goma guide. Well, just some helpful hints. Hmm. Oh, oh, we got Spino. That's nice. So we should have some type advantage. Not that it'll help, but, you know. We can use this Spino to finish off Eokark number two. And then it can tank a hit from... And then we can have it get swept by the Omega on it. And then we'll have Zuni Ceratops left. Cool, we can do this! Okay, let's see what he goes for. 
Oh, easy enough, we'll go paper. Boosh. Oh wow, <laughs> even with a type advantage, it did minimal damage. Skizzers. Oh, he threw a curveball, a little bugger. Okay, that actually does make a difference. A rock is probably the move you don't mind getting hit by. It does the least damage. I mean, it's not done a arse ton of damage, but it does the least damage. Ah, oh, thanks, Goma. That's correct. That means we are going to go for a water sword. Boosh! Oh, we got the support effect. Nice. Come on, Zumi Ceratops. Helping, her, helping out his pals. Okay, this... One more hit should do it after this. Oh, we're going to have to waste the Dino Tech there, but... Again, a tie will probably not kill it, and they'll kill us with the eruption. So here comes... So we went paper, so we're going to go scissors. Oh, oh, yes, easy enough, we'll go scissors. I mean, again, it's going to waste the Dino Tech there, but we need to kill this thing. And we need this Dino to survive for the Omega Armor to come in. And it's going through, so we're in good shape. Boosh! Yeah, we did it! Well, we almost did it. <laughs> wow, look how tiny the Zuni Ceratops is compared to the Spino. You can, like, step on it! <laughs> yeah, we did it! Or have we? Dun 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 dun. We all know what happened to you. Sorry, I just like to stop talking when it, when that montage when that like little bit plays. Yes, the Omega on the Eelcock here. I believe Gozzi is working on it for Evolution. Although I, I I personally think he's better off doing it for Evolution 2 now. Oh we got the first hit. Yeah, it's, it's a lottery sometimes, you know. If I got a hit there. Okay, that's a tie. We'll take that. Hmm. Let's go scissors again. Oh, we got the dino tap. Scissors? Oh, we got the hit! God, Spino! Like, this is kind of cheating, though, because I'm not using Zuni Ceratops. But... Hey, the person failed to specify the specifics for the challenge. Alright? <laughs> Oh, that did loads of damage. No, I don't want... I want to win with Zuni Ceratops. That's why I'm not swapping it in. You know, it's that I want this Spino to die. And Zuni Ceratops to get the finishing blow. Okay, I think that means he goes for his crept. Or not. Oh my god, I think we might do it with a Spino. God, Spinosaurus, you could do it. Okay, yeah, we're gonna do it with Spino. Oh, come on, it's a tie. Let's go, Rock. I wanna win with Spino. I wanna win with. Oh, no, we did it. Well, um, there we go. We won with Spino Tector, not Zuni Ceratops. <laughs> Hey, it counts. I did it with Zuni Ceratops. Be happy. Leave a comment. Subscribe. Epic win. I'm taking it. And yes, that, ladies and gentlemen, is how we beat Goma. So I hope my tips have helped. Will help you out. If not, then well, you you kind of, maybe uh, maybe you kind of suck. <laughs> But no, you know, my tips are, are helpful. They have, they do help, they will help you out. Some, you will lose sometimes, you know, it just happens. I'm not a pro at this, but... 
I do the best I can with the information I have. And it works. And I did it with Zuni Ceratops. And I completed the Zuni Ceratops challenge without using Zuni Ceratops. It was just in the team. Hey, actually, actually, no, no. It boosted the Spino's attack. So Zuni Ceratops did help. So Zuni Ceratops contributed to my victory. Therefore, I won with Zuni Ceratops. <sighs> right. That's going to end this session now. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, subscribe. And leave a comment down below. What other challenges should I do? And until then, this is Stranger Gamer, signing out.